Brownsville ISD is working to find out where they will be making cuts in their budget before heading into the new school year. Channel 5 Stephanie Rosales spoke with the superintendent about the impact on their budget. She joins us live outside the BISD administration building. Stephanie. No one will be let go in this process, the district says. However, some people will see a difference in their pay. It's a change some people are already dealing with. I'm hoping that we bring to the board a list of about 15 to 17 million dollars worth of cuts. That's the goal for Brownsville ISD Superintendent Dr. Jesus Chavez. Some of that money will come from consolidation of schools and staff. Dr. Chavez says they don't want to lose any staffers. Instead, they'll be moved into other available positions. He believes that will save the district around $8 million. We, in our process, are protecting classrooms, programs for kids, and teachers. We are going to continue to have a, a, a great education program for the students. The Texas Valley Educators Association supports BISD's plan. Executive Director Adina Alegria says there were several concerns with the reassignments. Some staffers will see a change in their pay. Behind it, as an association, we're like, okay, if a person gets reassigned, then ultimately they might lose a couple hundred, maybe up to a thousand dollars. Currently, we do have a member that lost up to five thousand dollars. She says while they were worried about this adjustment, the district acted fast to try to find help. Too, it was very fortunate that Human Resources, along with Dr. Chavez, is working diligently to getting her into another position that would um, not affect her so much. The district is looking for other ways to save to ensure future raises and school improvements. There are going to be some cuts. If, if we are able to make more cuts, then it may be that we are able to have more expenditures. Less cuts, well, then you can have less expenditures. With the $20 million budget deficit, they're hoping these changes will help them get out of the negatives. Reassigned staff members will finish out the year with their current pay. The new rate will kick in for the upcoming school year. The final approved budget will be made in the final at the end of June. Live in Brownsville, Stephanie Rosales, Channel 5 News at 6.